What's up guys, it's Ivan who won the past year and today I'm just going to be doing a replay video. So uh this is one of the matches from the card fight league. So anyways, we'll just get started and here we go. Alright, so this game is gonna be me playing Seekers versus uh, Great Nature. So yeah, uh Opening up my hand is actually okay, so this hand here, it's not bad. Um, as long as you don't get like <laughs> great stuff, it's usually a pretty decent hand. Uh, I have some options here. I can ride into Blaster Blade, and then uh, if he plays anything in the front row, I can retire it. But he's gonna play pretty passive, yeah. So I'm just going to ride into probably my no Blaster Blade doesn't matter really. Try checking with my Thing Saver. This is really bad. Uh, <laughs> Two things savers. So he's playing the Shatnoir variant, which is actually before this game I didn't really know too much about what the great all the great nature stuff did, but anyways. So here I stride and took a blade. And then I'm gonna play uh probably yeah, Prismy. I swing Vanguard, he just no guards it, so I get my entire uh sword me combo off. And he heal he just he just heals a lot this match. Not even gonna lie. So I go into Knight of Twin Sword and then go into Sword Me and then Sword Me Skill again full column. Suddenly bam, full field. It's pretty good, but um he's about to start striding and getting like huge amount of field off. As you can see here, I don't have any perfect guards, so I can't actually perfect guard the first uh backguard hit, which really sucks, but yeah, because then he gets to like drop billion cards with this and it just sucks for me. Yeah, this is gonna be really slow because uh well Great nature takes forever, so. Oh man, he just draws a million cards. And then he keeps healing. Like, oh man. This is actually really annoying. And then I lose my perfect guard. Awesome. So I am obviously gonna guard that, because those are easy 10k shields, and I'm already pretty high behind on damage wise, so. Don't want to get screwed over. And then here we're just going to wait and wait for him to resolve everything. Just going to keep drawing cards. He draws his heals, but that's okay. I don't know that. So I'm going to strive with the Fang Saber because, uh, yeah. I, uh, Fang Saber is not going to help me right now. He's going to perfect guard this for sure. And he already had a perfect guard in the drop. So here I just swing 16, 16, and he's just gonna guard both of them. His hand's pretty small, but I don't have a lot of guard in hand. This is all like mostly 5k shields. So he strides again into Phoenix, the Phoenix guy. So I don't really care because I have a lot of, uh, in hand. A lot of these guys in hand, the not Grade twos. Oh man, thank goodness I actually heal because like this guy just keeps like checking triggers on me. It's actually ridiculous. So he uses Crayon Tiger, we stand this guy. I'm just gonna take it because whatever. I wanna just have to heal my way out, so it's no problem. He just draws cards, it's like retarded. So here I go into Fang Saber because I need to re-legion my triggers back in. And my extra cards have been saved so bad. And then I'm going to use File Skill probably, but I'm not sure how many Buster Blades I have. Like yeah, I'm just going to do Double Margle. So that works as well. And I finally got a crit. It's good. So he's probably also going to no guard this one as well. Oh no, he perfect guards that. Okay. And I finally got a heal. Thank goodness. Heal the heal for trigger. And then do it again. And then he guards this as well, no pass. That's fine. So he's probably gonna take the model crit, and then he's going to discard this one here. 
barely has enough. Like, I depleted his whole hand, which is really good. But, here, Tester Fox, like, plus Chat Noir just, like, completely screws me. Just because of, like, how much advantage he gets off of it, it's actually really stupid. And then he's going to Legion back two PGs, two heals. So, yeah, he's going to draw, like, okay, j just watch his hand size. Right now, he has one card in hand. After this turn, he's going to have around, like, a full hand again. So, yeah. I didn't really know. This is really stupid. Um, Tester Fox, his ability can activate in the end phase after you stride. So that's actually really stupid. I don't know. Uh, I don't know why it works like that, but it does. And then he heals again. This is like the fourth time he's healed. Okay. <laughs> I'm probably just gonna eat one of these attacks. Cause yeah, heal. I kind of need to heal, so. So now I'm just waiting to draw my last copy of Pink Saber, I believe. Yeah, I should still have one more copy of Pink Saber, so I need to re Legion really badly. But I take that hit because I need to conserve this hand. Okay, he has 3 cards right now, right? He had 1 before. He's gonna draw 2. No, he's gonna draw like four cards from the. Yeah, so he's gonna draw four cards and then search two persona copies and then unflip the damage for it. So total, he's gonna get like another six cards in hand, which is uh really ridiculous because two of them are perfect cards. He just gets both his perfect cards back. Like, man, this guy's gr this guy's just really good. No, no, the thing that's stupid about this is he can just put heal triggers back in the deck, which becomes relevant later because he somehow gets like four heal triggers in like a nine card deck. But he draws one of them, which is fine. Uh, test, yeah, great nature, it just has a lot of abilities that you need to remember what they do, but honestly, like, it's really silly because they also don't deck out very easily, of course, Tester Fox, so. So yeah, um, he goes from 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. 9 cards in hand. That's amazing. So I'm going to stride into St. Blow, because, yeah. Oh no, I'm going to Samuli, because I know that he has a... Oh man, he needs damage triggers like a boss. Because I know he has perfect cards in hand, so I'm just going to guarantee the damage to pressure him harder. So here I, I split it like that, because uh, this force is a 5, and this force is a 15, so it technically it's more efficient this way for me to force guard out. So yeah, I'm pretty de doing pretty decent hand-wise. However, here I believe he goes into... Uh, he strides again. And this is where I find out how stupid this combo really is, because he can freaking... Uh, activate the ability in the end phase, and it's just really dumb, honestly. Okay. And I'll show you my misplay where I should have won this game, but I actually lose this game because I am silly and I don't account for people healing on me. So, like, he basically goes all in this turn, but you, you want to see, like, how many cards he gets, like, afterwards? It's just insane. Like, yeah. I, I managed to guard this because uh, I have a lot of hand, as you can see. Like I'm actually about to deck out, but yeah. I really need to draw into my last copy of Fing Saber. So I perfect guard. Okay. He checks one, two, three criticals, okay? Like I <laughs> It's just very frustrating dealing with this. <laughs> oh man. Like, I know I sound salty, but like, you have no idea how frustrating it is to deal with this kind of stuff. It's just actually insane. Like, man. <laughs> and then here is the re moment where I realized suddenly that he can activate the ability like at that timing it's just insane it still works I'm like what you can do that after he strides that's insane 
But yes, um, I as I said previously, I just really need to draw into my last copy of Fing Saber here and just be Legion. No, he he still needs to put back two. He's gonna put back two heals. That that's just like what? Like he has like a nine card deck just full of heals. Like actually, no, I'm not kidding. He he has no heals. All four heals are in his deck. So this is the part where I honestly screw up, and I should have a. Uh... Okay, I could have actually won this game. I I calculated this wrong. So yeah, th that was right because I didn't realize that this was a 10k attacker here. So yeah, I swing. Right, he's gonna guard it for. Uh... And also the thing is that since this is, I should have remembered his drive checks exactly because uh, when he guards with uh, this, this, and this here. I should have remembered that he had exactly two 10k shields left in his hand. Like, I know he heal sacks me, but like, that's still my own fault for not actually, uh, counting. Yeah, sorry for the spoiler alert. But, yeah, um, I should have counted. But I think I was really tired and very, honestly, very frustrated with how many triggers he was getting on me, so, yeah. This is a really long game. It was actually like a 30 minute game, but, it's a lot slower. Here I made a mistake. I should have put the crit here. Cause uh I should have swung uh Yeah, I don't know why I did this, honestly. Cause if I if I swung here and he had to take one of them, he he just heals, right? And then he has exactly enough. I screwed up. I should have put the crit on here. So it's my own fault I lose this game, but yeah, and then a uh, thing saver just trolls me. It's like, huh, okay. Um, I'm just gonna show up now, like when it's way too late. Okay, ha ha ha. That's very funny. But yeah, now I just straight up lose the game because uh, cause I'm goofed. I'm goofed, and it's just really frustrating. Uh man, I hate it when I draw like draw the card I need, the turn I need it, like when I just drive check it. So you're just gonna stride to Magnamar and just straight up kill me now. Oh no, not Magnamar, just to be... Yeah, I had to heal on him, but I'm not gonna heal, so, spoiler alert. And he's just gonna check more heals. Oh man, I gotta... Please stop healing. Oh <laughs> uh, yeah, so that's about the game for this one. The second game's not as interesting. This game was actually a really close game, but, uh... Like I said, I screwed up. I could have won the game if I remembered what his drive checks were. Because this is card fight area, you can see uh, what you can see exactly the order like they they do the cards in because they can't hand shuffle. So I could have actually remembered exactly what he had in his hand, but I didn't. So to be honest, I was really tired. So usually when I'm tired, I don't memorize like drive checks and stuff very well. So yeah, uh, it's unfortunate. I lost the series uh, 2 to 0 because next game I didn't open as well, and then he just didn't let Gublade hit ever because he just got all the perfect guards in hand. So, yeah, I should have honestly played just stuck with playing Aqua Force just because uh, it's way better to close out games. Like, Bing Saber is a bit more grindy sometimes if your opponent is playing something like Great Nature and then they have enough guard to survive your double restand and outsmile and same blows. So, yeah. Overall, uh, this was a pretty. It was a pretty decent match, actually. It's just I was I got really frustrated with how many like kills and crits that this guy got. But you know what? It's Vanguard, so whatever. So yeah, uh, thanks for watching this one. I'm not gonna upload a second game video because uh, watching Great Nature games versus Fang Saber is not very interesting. So yeah, just like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time.